Good morning, I'm Silvia Bellacicco, speaking on behalf of Lazio Region, the lead partner of the European project COSGAP. I'm glad to present you the general framework of this project, its strategy, aim and the expected results. COSGAP project, whose extended title is Coastal Governance and Adaptation Policies in the Mediterranean, is funded by the MED program and it concerns issues related to coastal planning and management for specific tar target beneficiaries, the public administrations in charge of planning and managing the coastal or their territories. COSGAP is an ambitious project, not really for the budget committed, but for the aims of the project itself and for the involvement of 15 partners representing seven EU countries Italy, Spain, France, Greece, Cyprus, Croatia and Germany. COSGAP involves both public administrations in charge of coastal management or their agency on behalf of both research institutes which focus their studies on coastal management that committed themselves in transferring the project products to related coastal public administration as in this case the University Pablo de Olavide of Sevilla is doing with these local meetings. This is a quick view of the distribution of coastal partners around the Mediterranean and we can clearly see that most of the countries of the north side of Med Basin and then the, the needs of these countries regarding coastal management are well represented. Coast Gap is a capitalization project. It means that it works with the best deliverables, called here best practices, produced by other past projects on coastal issues in order to capitalize them. In other words, in order to increase their value and their impact, making them effectively available and useful for the target beneficiaries. COSGAP selected 12 best practices developed by several EU projects on coastal sustainable management as interesting products for coastal public administrations, supporting them in coastal planning and, and management. At the end of the project, COSGAP will actually provide to these EU and MED coastal public administrations efficient technical and administrative tools for coastal planning and management. COSGAP lasts 18 months and will end at the end of 2014. The budget is 1,360,000 euros. These are the best practices on coastal management selected in COSGAP to be capitalized. They come from several EU projects and concern different aspects of coastal management as the environmental impact assessment of coastal works, the ICZM protocol implementation, the coastal data management, the coastal sediment management, the coastal risk evaluation, the coastal survey, etc. All of them propose good methods and models to support coastal public administrations both in their daily work as the permission on coastal zones, the planning of coastal uses and intervention, and last but not least, the coastal policy decision making. But let's see how COSGAP runs to capitalize all these best practices, that is, the process of capitalization. It's an intensive process involving all the partners, both the proposing partners, who brought the best practices in COSGAP, and the adopting partners, which are interested in analyzing, customizing and adopting these best practices according to their coastal territorial needs and features. The capitalization process is split in four steps. The presentation of the best practices by the relevant proposing partners. The analysis and the exchange of information between the proposing partners and the adopting partners to allow the best customization and mainstreaming of the best practices, the identification and application of the adaptation and customization measures to the best practices by the adopting partners, 
the formal adoption of the best practices by the adopting partners through an official commitment act. Before running one by one the four steps, let's see who decided to capitalize and what. This table shows the interest declared by each partner in capitalizing the selected best practices. I remind you that those partners, which are research institutes then public administration, can't adopt formally the best practices, but they committed themselves in transferring the project products to related coastal public administrations, as in this case, the University Pablo de Olavide of Sevilla is doing through this meeting. We can see that we expect around 60 adoption of customized best practices at the end of coastal projects. The first step of the capitalization process concerns the presentation of each best practice by the proposing partner to the partners interested in their adoption, arranging a technical report which explains the practical aim of the best practice, its current level of development and its efficiency to support cost of planning and management, its technical transferability potential and other general information about the best practice. These general reports are available on COSGAP website in English. The second step of the capitalization process concerns the analysis and the in-depth verification from a technical, formal and administrative side of the transferability of the best practice by the relevant adopting partners and then the delivery of their proposals of adaptation measures to be applied to these best practices in order to customize and mainstream them according to each specific needs and territorial features. If needed, the best practices have been translated in proper language in order to share them easily with officers in charge for analyzing them. The third step of the capitalization process concerns then the production of appropriate technical acts by the adopting partners to allow their internal administrative receiving and adoption of the customized best practices. The fourth step of the capitalization process concerns then the best practices adoption by the adopting partners through formal administrative acts. Finally, Internal and external actions are expected to effectively mainstream and spread out the tailor-made best practices, for example, into own funding programs, regulations, procedures, etc., and to stakeholders other than the European and MED coastal public administrations. Deliverables will be the administrative acts of the adoption of best practices, and they will be available from the end of October 2014 on COSGAP website. The customized best practices will be free and directly available on the COSGAP website, arranged into a technical and administrative toolbox for the coastal governance and adaptation policies and actions, at disposal of any interested stakeholder. Another aspect of coastal project, more strategic and then complementary in the capitalization process, is related to the design of a joint action plan, basing on the technical and administrative toolbox, with the aim of concretizing priority initiatives on med coastal areas to face climate change effects. The JAP will launch indeed several concrete actions on the Mediterranean coastal zone through a macro project, BeachMed 3. We really believe that COSGAP planning tools can be useful to support the coastal public administration in their work. So please, we are at your disposal for any questions about the project and the toolbox. Feel free to contact us if you are interested in having more information on it. Thank you for your attention and goodbye.